how to be attractive in his eyes. Hello, ladies, and welcome to this new video. My name is Alex Kamont. I'm your French relationship expert, and I want to talk about attraction. What men want, but also how can you really be attractive in his eyes? Because I know you want him, but you don't want to lose yourself. And I want to congratulate you on this. I'm glad to be your coach. I'm glad to push you with every single video that I'm doing to learn more about what you expect, what you want, to make sure that you will prioritize yourself. You will make yourself on a pedestal. Before I tell you my advice, how to be attractive in his eyes, I want to make sure that you will smash the like button and subscribe. I want you to join this amazing community of women from all over the world. And when I do my lives, you're here to support each other. And this is just the best gift for me. So I know that you want this guy. I know that you want to be with him. And you will ask me, Alex, how can I be attractive in his eyes? How can I be the one? How can I make him want to be with me? Usually, you will tell me, do I have to make him as a priority? Do I have to please him? The answer is, of course, no. Wow. This is a shock. Every time I do a video and I say this, people are shocked. But Alex, you know, he's different. He's stubborn. If I don't give him, I won't get anything from him. I don't want you to be in a one-sided relationship. So I don't want you to think that because you love him, you have to do everything. And the reason why, it's very simple. Because if you do everything and he does nothing, when do you think that he will start being involved? Because you think that maybe the moment you will be in a relationship, when we will get married, when we will have kids, then he will commit. Seriously? No, 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 no. This is very dangerous. This is how your friends and some people that you know got their life destroyed. Lack of self-confidence. They are not happy. Every time you see them, they are complaining. Their life is a disaster. Why? Because they stayed in this toxic environment. So what I want to do today is to help you be attractive in his eyes by allowing you to be more confident. By allowing you to be in a positive energy. And so I have just four advice. That's it. Four advice. You apply them. You won't be single anymore. You will find the one. You will be able to attract him, keep him, and make him and you happy. Because the goal is not to be in a relationship and we are not happy. Right? The goal is to enjoy. Step number one. A man will always find a woman very attractive if she is happy, if she's enjoying her life. So ladies, instead of being mad because you're single, instead of telling yourself, oh my God, I don't have kids, I'm 35, oh my God, because this is what we can feel. And trust me, when a man will meet you, this is the first thing first he will look at. Are you smiling? Are you positive? Are you enjoying every single second? Are you someone that I can, you know, enjoy my life? That's what we think. So step number one, if you really want to be attractive in his eyes, you need to start loving your life. Step number two, men, we want a woman that will have self-confidence. Alex, wow, this is very basic. I read that I know before that. I watch videos. Everyone say the same. Not really. I will explain to you why and what do I mean by someone that has real self-confidence. Because you love this man, right? You want to be with him. Or at least you want to find a good man. The number one issue is when you will seek validation. When a man feels that you're seeking his validation, there is no more excitement. He cannot put you on a pedestal. He cannot value you. He will tell himself, this is just a sex friend. 
but no more. Nothing more. Why? Because when you seek validation, you're giving us to control. And that's not what I want. So step number one, you need to love your life. Step number two, you need to be confident. Don't seek his validation. So if you want to organize something, do it. Don't ask him, do you feel it's a good idea? Do you want to do it? No, that is a sign of weakness. So you need to trust yourself. Step number three, if you want to be attractive in his eyes, you need to have passions and goals. If you know where you're going, if you have a lot of, not a lot, some activities that you just enjoy, maybe you love to play piano, maybe you love to play basketball, whatever you love to do, the more passions and goals you have, the more this guy will tell himself, this is real. The man will tell himself, I need to be strong, to help her achieve her goals. So let's say you want to create your company. I will come as a man to assist you, to support you. And I love this position. First of all, because it would create this idea of partners in crime. And also, because I feel like a man. I feel like I can help you. I can be on your side. I feel that you need me. Wow, that's a lot of value. When in reality, we are not seeking for the idea that we need him. We are just talking about your goals. Talking about how do you see your life. This is very exciting for a guy. The last sign that I wanted, the last step that I wanted to tell you, if you really want to be attractive in his eyes, and this one is just the most difficult one for all the women that I have coached, I will ask you to learn to receive and not try to give back. What do I mean by that? Most of the time, ladies, when you meet a guy that is a potential, he has the potential to be the number one. He has the potential to marry you. You want to be with him. He's a good man, right? He will chase you. He knows you're a catch, ladies. You're a high-value woman. So I need to chase her. Let me organize something amazing. Deep inside you, you feel that because he has done something amazing, you need to give back. And when you do this, you're first of all not being in your feminine energy. You are demasculinizing and you're not showing that you can enjoy the moment. You put pressure on you. If you do this for me, I have to do that for you. It doesn't become natural. So, I know it's weird, but I've asked so many women and I will ask you as well, please, make sure right now that you will learn how to receive that you will learn how to make him give you more, how to make him come to you. That is what we are looking for. So tell me, ladies, are you ready to use these tools, these four steps to be very attractive in his eyes? Which one is the most difficult? Which one is the weirdest? Tell me in the comments. Let's continue this conversation together. But I want to tell you something. This is just the only way to be so attractive and you at the same time. No need to play games. No need to chase. No need to put him on a pedestal. The only one thing you need to do is to smash the like button and join this community. And if you want to go further, just look in the description. You have free resources. I do live masterclass. I do private coaching. And I have online training as well. All to show you that this philosophy, even if I talk, you know, with some humor, even if I want to make you smile, this is how you will stop suffering. This is how you will stop putting him on a pedestal. And this is how you will start honoring yourself. Because you need to honor your personality. So important for me. Okay, ladies, I will see you soon for a new video. Take good care of yourself. 